In this video, you'll learn how to get ready to implement Marketing Cloud Personalization, formerly known as Interaction Studio. We'll guide you through five crucial steps to ensure a smooth implementation. This timeline shows five standard stages of a typical personalization implementation project. Don't focus on the details here. It's just an example of all the tasks you'll get into later in your project. Keep this big picture in mind as we consider the five upcoming preparation steps. Step one, change management. Consider how this new tool will affect your people, processes, and existing technology. For people, think about the new responsibilities your teams will take on using personalization. Consider how the current team structures and skill sets do or don't support your goals for personalization. For process, consider ideation, workflow, and measurement. For technology, look into architecture, compliance, and governance. Plan accordingly to prepare everyone involved at every step of the process. Step two, build your implementation team. For the initial technical configuration, we strongly recommend using a trained implementation partner who is certified in marketing cloud personalization. Working with experienced experts ensures a smooth and quick implementation. Select the right implementation expert based on your business needs. Contact your account executive for guidance. Step three, identify stakeholders. From C-suite to day-to-day -day marketers, get the right people involved. You'll need to identify an executive sponsor, program owner, channel leads, and cross-functional representatives, designate someone to have the account administrator user role in personalization, and get to know your account team at Salesforce. Identify key stakeholder functions and ensure they are aware, committed, and trained for their role in your implementation project and beyond. Here are three program stakeholder functions to identify. The function is more important than the number of people or their titles. The first functional group are leaders who set the program vision and ensure cross-functional alignment. The second group develops the strategy, creates organizational best practice, and drives expansion. These are roles like product manager, program manager, tech or IT leads, analytics lead. The third functional group of end users implement, measure, and optimize your use of personalization. Step four, outline your strategic plan Define your goals, identify use cases, review implementation steps, and plan your timeline. Your personalization strategy should line up with your overall business objectives. For more detail on how to plan for success, watch the Start Your BVM video to kickstart your value mapping exercise. Step five, share resources. Ensure key users have access to eCampus, Salesforce help resources, internal documentation, and set a due date for eCampus Learning Path 1. Access the knowledge base on help.salesforce.com for articles, glossaries, FAQs, and guidance for all things personalization. Developers, you'll also want to bookmark our developer knowledge base, Developer Docs. eCampus is our main platform for training and enablement. Navigate to eCampus and click Request an eCampus Login. Look for the message that says, are you a marketing cloud personalization customer? Request an eCampus login. We provide two learning paths, one for business users and one for developers. Choose end user or developer, and that will define the learning paths you see in eCampus. If you're setting up eCampus logins for your whole team, be mindful of who needs what learning path. Set a due date for everyone on your team to complete Learning Path 1. Let's review the five steps to prepare for your Marketing Cloud Personalization implementation. First, consider how change will affect your people, process, and technology. Next, get connected with an expert to help your implementation go smoothly. Third, get the right internal people involved. Then outline your strategy, including goals and key use cases. Finally, share resources with stakeholders and set a deadline for everyone to complete the first learning path. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or visit us on the trail at trailhead.salesforce.com. Thanks for watching.